How's it going guys, Panther Films here, and today we're going to be reacting to Season 1, Episode 1 of Moon Knight. This episode is titled, The Goldfish Problem. I don't really know too much about Moon Knight as a character, other than, you know, he suffers from multiple personality disorder, and he shit on Frank Castle for losing his family in a comic panel that I remember, so that's funny. And he's basically Marvel's version of Batman. Pretty much. Hopefully this show is fairly brutal, because from the trailer it kind of gave off them vibes. So maybe this will be kind of the future style for more mature shit in Marvel. But Deadpool 3 is going to be happening, and they've just brought Daredevil and Punisher onto Disney+. Plus. So who knows, maybe they will be doing R-rated content soon. Who knows. I'm excited to see how Oscar Isaac plays this kind of character. What kind of villains we'll have, what kind of mythos we'll get, because we're obviously going to get a new mythos with this kind of character, right? It makes sense. But yeah, that basically wraps up the shitty recap. Let's stop doolallying around and get right into the fucking episode. What the fuck? Oh shit, dude, it's Ethan Hawke. Why? Don't tell me he's gonna walk in that. Oh my god. Why? What the fuck? But why, dude? Thought they'd do a different kind of style of intro for this kind of show, but... Like, it keeps on changing, like, multiple personalities, but... Hey, I guess I should have been in charge of that intro. I remember this from the trailer, isn't he, like, chained to the bed or some shit? Yeah. Wait, it was that easy to take off? Also, was that sand around the bed? Oh, I love, I love his like British accent. Go up the old nozzle and. Oh yeah. All the organs would come out. You're not the bloody tour guide, Stevie. Stephen. Bloody useless unless you're actually doing what you're paid to do. Yeah, but I mean, if he makes a good tour guide. They didn't have that back then, did they? No. They had <laughs> and... Are we still on the seven tomorrow? Are you asking me out? You're funny. <laughs> I'll see you then. Did he forget? What in the world's a bloody vegan going to eat in a steakhouse? Bread. Real catch you are. Alright, okay, calm down. The oh, third time this week again. you've shuffled in like a lazy oh, sod. That's why you'll be on inventory this week. Well done. <laughs> Please, if this is some weird audition to tour guide here, the answer's still no. That's actually crushing to hear. <laughs> They've got seven gods here and the only other has nine. I fired two of them for being late. I mean, you're a museum. You, you shouldn't be getting shit like that wrong. <laughs> What if he did when, when he changes into Moon Knight? I wonder if he kills him. <laughs> what do you think? He's talking nah, to a right, statue. I mean, I well, not a statue. Strange. Anyway, if I am gonna have a girlfriend, obviously can't have ankle restraints from a bed, can I? Nice catching up. Oh, that's a good shot. That's good. I mean, that's not gonna do anything if you change into another personality. Let's start with trying to solve a puzzle. Try a book. Is there an exciting chapter you'd like to be a part of? So this is how he stays in one personality, right? <laughs> Oh, maybe not. What the fuck? Oh, where the fuck is he? What? Go back to sleep. You're not supposed to be here. The idiot's in control. Oh. What the fuck? Oh, he fell out the window. What a weird, like, what the fuck? How did this happen? So you're telling me he changed into another personality and ended up in God knows where? Why is there just armed militia? The way he runs. <laughs> yeah, that's not sus. Don't they know what you look like? Haven't they identified you? Oh, here he is. Fucking Ethan Hawke. What a beautiful day. Like we're in heaven. What's gonna happen? His life's in the balance or some shit? Yeah. This is the face of a good man. And if you're a bad man, what happens? Who would like to go next? I must know. What are you doing? See, I don't know what to call him. Do I call him, like, Stephen? Do I call him Mark? He's got... I just call him Moon Knight. It's easier. Uh-oh. I'm sorry. What does that mean? I wish you could live to see the world we make. What the fuck? So he just kills her? I'm sorry. Someone killed two of our men. Do I have a meat? Oh, bollocks. <laughs> Mercenary. Oh, I work at a gift shop. Um, my name's Stephen Grant. Will you return the scarab? You will give him nothing. <laughs> <laughs> it's not him doing it. Come on. That's 
so strange. Sorry about that. I'm trying to give it to you! Wait, 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 wait! Uh-oh, now he's gonna change. No, the idiot's back. I wanna go, all right? <laughs> Who did he change? Like, what, how did he change there? What What did they see? Don't you dare drop the scarab! All right, all right, all right! Oh, my God. oh there's cupcakes back there. It has to be a dream. I mean, it isn't a dream. Come on, you bloody cupcake man! At least you're going downhill, so it speeds it up a little bit. Oh, chickens! One shot. Oh, I thought they were going to keep it a one shot. God damn it. <laughs> oh, what is this? Fast and Furious? What the fuck? Yeah. Fuck, cupcake guy. Why, why shoot the guy that's driving? What the fuck just happened? What just happened? He changed again? <laughs> what a weird fucking show, dude. And he's changed again. Wait, he's going backwards? What the fuck? He's reversing. He's reversing. Did yeah, that didn't. The gun? I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> leave <us> be. <laughs> Who's that voice? Is that Oscar Isaac? Because that sounds like a voice I know. Uh oh. Oh! Wait, so that all happened, but because he kept switching back and forth between other personalities, like he wasn't supposed to, he was always supposed to wake up in bed. But now he thinks it's a dream, which obviously it wasn't. Like he always does shit at night, you know, in other places with different personalities, but he always comes back here. Is it a different goldfish? It's got two, two fins now. Fish. Oh, for God's sake, dude, why did I drop the F-bomb? Yeah, he's got two fins now, so is that, is that normal? Look, as I said, they've so, all got two fins. It's a clock, right? Fish is wrong, the time is wrong, you're not quite right. Why would he not check the time beforehand? Look like a knob. <laughs> like a knob. So you can say that, but you can't say fuck. Did he miss it? What time is it? Maybe it's another day. I'm at the restaurant. I ate steak by myself, thanks. Two days ago. Welcome to Sunday. Lose my number. <laughs> Cheers. I mean, you, don't you work together? Kind of weird saying lose my number when you work together. What day is it today? Sunday, so. He's another personality for one day, and then he's another personality on another day, and then he comes back to this personality. Looks like he was just focused on his face there. Gators, gators. He's not speaking to anyone, is he? Just eating all the chocolates to himself. Jesus Christ. Oh, that's how he got out. It's wacky, because it's like, you're just not used to this kind of storytelling. It's cool. What is that? Is that where the scarab is? I like that shot though, it kind of looked like a pyramid there. I've been texting and calling you for months. Where have you been? I just found this phone in my flat and I'm just trying to figure out what? whose it is. Who do you think I am? What's wrong with you, Mark? Why did you call me Mark? Is Mark the one that's Moon Knight? Steven. What the fuck? You're gonna get yourself in trouble. No, no, no. There's like Vite in my ear. Oh, he's going to transform in the mirror. Yep, the reflection hasn't changed. Steven. What is happening? Wait, is this the same floor? It's a loop, but you're just stuck on the same floor forever. It's a good shot. No floor two. What the fuck is that, dude? <laughs> Wait, so she's... That weird fucking Egyptian thing? Why is he on the fifth? Oh. Okay, maybe it wasn't. That what? Jesus. What is happening, dude? Uh. This is. This is mind fucking me. <laughs> oh what? God. He's real. Ethan Hawke's there. This man right here, he's been following me. No, I don't know. Wait, it's only. I don't have your bloody beetle, I swear. No, the, the, the scarab doesn't belong to me, it belongs to her. So is everyone who works here part of this, like, weird cult? I mean, why would you surround the guy that Consider this. clearly killed a lot of your people? Been free by even her own avatar. Avatars, mm -hmm. blue people, love that film. By avatar, <laughs> you mean that? I mean, anime. Okay. Steven, are you going to kill me? Because when you threaten his life, that's when he changes, right? I am trying to help you. It's gonna blow Ethan Hawke back. It's gonna like hurt Ethan Hawke, or it won't make a decision. Because there's so many personalities, it, it can't handle it. There's chaos in you. Chaos! Holy shit. I just clicked. Hello? Donna? JB? That reflection was late. Yeah. What the fuck? 
That's a yes. Oh, what is that, dude? Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm, I'm, I'm out. I'm leaving. <laughs> Ta-ta, dude. Give oh. me the scarab, and you won't be torn apart. Ethan Hawke sent these things in? What the fuck? Oh, I, n I remember this from the trailer. Look at me. This is real. I'm real. Look at me. Oh. Oh. There it is. Oh. Yeah, he changed in time. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. Oh. Was that a person, though? And then the end of the episode there. God damn it, dude. They showed the final shot of the first episode in the fucking trailer. What the fuck? That was... Confusing. Intriguing. And exciting. All at the same time. Like, I'm, I'm very intrigued with this show. Because something like this hasn't been done in Marvel live action that I know of. Right? So, it's exciting and it... It keeps you intrigued because you're like you're trying to figure out what's going on, like the character is, and it's also confusing because I don't know what to call the character. Do I call the character Stephen? Do I call the character Mar? Do I call it Moon Knight? I, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm interested to see if Moon Knight is a god or not, because it makes sense if he was some kind of like demigod. I do wonder if Ethan Hawke's character is from the comics. He probably is, but very interesting character, like. He puts people's lives in the balance. He's got scales on him. That's pretty cool. But with Steven, that isn't the case. Because Steven has obviously got multiple personalities. So the scales can't decide which personality is the good or bad one. And they call it chaos. Chaos! I'm curious what happened to the fish. The fish with one fin. Did, like, Mark kill it or something? I mean, it's gone, so he probably died. Right? Also, at the beginning of the episode... His restraints on his legs. He easily took that off, didn't he? So, I mean... Plus, can't, can't the other personalities still see what Steven's seeing? Surely they can. They just can't take control because Steven's like probably holding them back. Maybe maybe each episode will get a new personality. That will be pretty cool. But this episode was Steven, next episode is Mark, and the third episode is someone else, fourth is someone else, fifth is someone else, and then sixth is like this big ultimate thing. I'm curious if like Ethan Hawke's character is human too. Like, I wonder if he's like Moon Knight and he transforms. Because, I mean, you can't have a fight with a guy that doesn't really know how to fight. It seems a bit unfair. So, like, he's probably going to transform at some point in the season. Yeah, I mean, at the end there, I like the costume of Moon Knight. I think it looks very... Really Somewhat comic book accurate. I think there's slight differences, but it, it looks good. Now, I don't know if it's actually CG or practical. Hopefully, it's a bit of both. It's a nice little mix. This show seems to give off brutal vibes, but at the same time, it still seems a bit PG. You know? Like, you have the blood, and you you have all this brutal shit happening. Like, the ending, when he's beating the shit out, like, the, uh, the wolf or whatever it is. Right? And then... You have shit like, what the fish? You know, like, come on, Marvel. Come on. I mean, I know it's not Marvel's fault. Marvel Studios probably wants to have F-bombs and, you know, more brutal shit in it. But it's just Disney. Because Disney have literally just censored Falcon and the Winter Soldier. One of the episodes from that where there's blood in it. And they've removed the blood. So I wouldn't put it past Marvel to censor this. Maybe it's already been censored on Disney+. Plus. Maybe Moon Knight's already been censored. Maybe in, in another version he did say what the fuck. But to be fair, they, they, they have that as like a running joke in the MCU. Like characters are about to say what the fuck. And then it, they cut it off with something. Like it happened in Spider-Man Homecoming. It happened in Spider-Man Far From Home. And it happened in Spider-Man No Way Home. Biggest corporation and yet they won't allow F-bombs. Like you can't have a subscription service or streaming service and not have a variety of content. You've got Die Hard on Disney Plus, and Aliens on Disney Plus, and Walking Dead on Disney Plus. So, what's wrong with like some f bombs here and there? You know what I'm saying? I just don't understand that mindset. Like, oh yeah, showing like fucking Thanos beat the shit out of this character is fine, but f bomb? Nope, too far. Or like you know, uh, Falcon and Winter Soldier. When was it? Is it John Walker? Uh, you know, agent, US agent, fucking slamming Captain America's shield into that guy. 
with blood all over it. Are they going to censor that and remove the blood? I, oh, I swear to God, if they do that. Maybe maybe the, the censored thing with Falcon and Winter Soldier is like they're testing like the parental control shit. So if you have the censor on it, it it changes the episodes a little bit. Some of the shots in the episode were really good. I like 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 where you have a bit of the scene and then you have the reflection of it. I, I like them kind of shots. I, I always, I don't know, something about them just looks appealing. And then you've obviously got the shot of, you know, the pyramid when he was looking through the hole, it kind of looked like a triangle or a pyramid, which was cool. And also, the soundtrack was pretty good. And then the action scenes, I'd say, well, I mean, we didn't really see any, to be honest. <laughs> you know? Uh, until the end, I guess. Like, that two to three punches on that werewolf-looking motherfucker. The thing that's annoying me is that I don't know too much about ancient Egypt mythology, other than, like, the big, big stuff, you know? So... It is what it is, I guess. Maybe the show will help me understand it a little bit more. Or maybe I should just read up on it a little bit. I don't know. Th this show is definitely going to prove that Oscar Isaac can act. Because that scene when he was at the table and he was confused about what day it was and stuff. Like he was on that, you know, the dinner date. And you just saw that emotion in his eyes. Like th this, this show is definitely going to prove how good of an actor he is. But, you know, I feel like he's already done that in other shit. It's just the more popular franchises, like Star Wars that he was in, didn't do him justice. I mean, to be fair, the sequel trilogy didn't do anyone justice. I'm, I'm very intrigued to see, like, where they go with this show. It's just, I, I thought there was going to be two episodes today, because I, I, I swear I heard, like, a couple of months back they were going to air episode one and two together, but I guess not. I'm fine with it either way. I mean, we've got another five weeks of this show, because I think there's six episodes in total. Depends on how they handle it because sometimes Marvel does this thing where it feels like not a lot's happening and then it feels a bit rushed towards the end. One division, you know, but we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Yeah, pretty solid first episode. I'm excited to see where we go next in Moon Knight. Hope you enjoyed the video, guys, and I will see you in the next one. Ta ta.